Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jamafrican Beauty back at you with another video. Actually, this is going to be a redo video. So, for all of my people who are out there on borrowed time and don't got time to watch no 35 minute videos, I totally understand. I don't know what I was thinking, but I am here to redo that video for you guys, okay? I have all my products here yet again, but I'm going to do a quick run through, and I mean quick run through of all of them. I'm gonna scale them maybe one to 10, or I'm gonna be like, I like this, I didn't like this, this one was okay, but I would buy it again, or I wouldn't, all that. So, without further ado, let's go. So, I'm gonna start off with shampoos. I use the TGIN like this it is a gentle clarifying shampoo so i really like this i think you can get away with using it once a week if you do shampoos once a week i also have the main choice ancient egyptian i really like this one but it's just so small you guys compared to that one so i will buy it again only if it's on sale but i like that one and that is a moisturizing shampoo this one right here is a clarifying shampoo it's specifically for your scalp i like this one it's from diva curl and i probably won't buy it again because diva curl is expensive i believe i got this on sale next last but not least not least i love my audra beauty it's a moisturizing shampoo you get 12 ounces um the only downfall is you can only buy this online and you have to pay for shipping so Ugh, I hate that, but love this. It's moisturizing, it smells like mint. I absolutely love it. It gets my hair clean, it gets the job done, and that's what I'm here for. All right, this is a rinse out conditioner from TGI N Line. Love it, it's about up to here. This is my second bottle of it. I like it because it moisturizes, so that gets, uh, I'll give it an eight out of 10, because this is the second time I bought it, so eight out of 10 for that. Now on to my co-washes, I use the Eden Body Works and the As I Am. I honestly love both of them, but if I had to choose from one to the other, I think I'd choose this one because I feel like this one cleans my hair just a little bit better than this one. I honestly only feel like this adds moisture back to my hair. So they both, I'll give this one a 10 and this one a nine. But I've been using this one for the longest. I just started using this one a couple months back and have been loving it so far. So let's move on to the deep conditioners. I have the My L Babasu and Mint Deep Conditioner. I really like this. It smells, uh, the mint smell is stronger. I would give this a 10 out of 10 because it moisturizes and it has some protein in there. So A++. This is the TGIN Honey Miracle. This is probably my favorite out of all three. Um, I love this because it has honey in it. My hair loves honey, so this gets a 10 out of 10. This is my second bottle. This is the Audra Beauty Deep Conditioning Treatment. Also smells like mint. I give this a 9 out of 10. I like it, um, but I'm still doing a trial period. I think I've only used it for two months. Now let's move to the leave-in conditioners. I have a whole lot of those. So this is the Trey Lux Untie the Knot really like this this is a 10 out of 10 i will purchase it again it is expensive though but it gets the job done and it gets the job done well this is the myel organics curl refresher spray i would buy this again and they both get 10 out of 10. this is my tgin leave-in as you can tell i love tgin uh, this is my second bottle. This is my third bottle. So I really like this one. It's amazing for my wash and goes. This is the, oh, the Audra Beauty leave-in. This one, I would say, this is a, when I tried the travel pack, it was a 10 out of 10. But now it, it doesn't provide me as much slip. So it's more like an 8, 7 out of 10. I don't know if I'd buy it again. This is the main choice Egyptian line leave-in like this. It mixes with all my eco stylers, so that gets a 10 out of 10. And it keeps my hair moisturized. This is the Cantu leave-in. I actually don't use it on my hair anymore. I used to use it on wash and froze, but now I use it in my weaves. And it gets a 
10 out of 10 because it gets the job done and I will repurchase it. This is a hair milk from Camille Rose. I just started using this, but so far so good. It adds a nice natural shine to my hair, so I'll give that a 10. Um, I'll give it a 9 because I may or may not repurchase it. If I can find a cheaper one, I'll use the cheaper one. This is the uh, yeah, Miel Pomegranate and Honey Leave-In. I use this under the Curl Scoping Custard. Love it because it keeps my hair moisturized when I do wash and go, so that gets a 10 out of 10. I would have repurchased it. This is the Camille Rose Leave-In Honey. I will repurchase this. I use this on my hair when I do blowouts like this, and it works awesome. My hair is always nice and soft, which is a plus, 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 plus. Oh, I did not talk about these. Okay, let's backtrack a little bit. The Cantu uh, Shampoo and Conditioner, Rinse Out Conditioner. These two get a 10 out of 10. I will repurchase them. I use them on all my clip-ins, sew-ins, or basically um, my extension hair. They get the job done. Oh, I skipped this too. This is a deep conditioner. The coconut, the jojoba and Manoy from Eden Body Works. I love this. I actually used this on my hair last night too and mixed it with the protein treatment. I would rebuy this 10 out of 10. It doesn't smell the greatest, but my hair felt great and looked great. So let's go to the curl defining creams. Okay. So let's get this started. Actually, I haven't used that one. I'm going to cut that. The Twisting Souffle from Mayel. Love this. I, has balm I get palm twist outs when I use it, so that is a rebuy and a 10 out of 10. Curl Defining Cream. This is expensive, y'all, but this works such great, so great on my hair that I'm going to give it an 11 out of 10. It gets extra credit for the amount of moisture retention that I got from it. It was amazing. I have a Curl Defining Cream from Eden Body Works. This is actually my first or it's my first bottle but I've used this on twist outs my twist outs last and it looks amazing on my hair this is a leave-in um look I got so many products I can't keep up this is a leave-in um from kinky curly I would give this a nine out of ten because I only really use it whenever I do wash and goes so um when I do my wash and goes with with kinky curly <coughs> excuse me it comes out great so I definitely will repurchase this again. So, and then let's go on to the double butter cream from As I Am. I will purchase this again. I actually already have. It smells great and gives me balm twist outs, and I could wear it under any Eco Style gel for a twist for a, a wash and go. The Curl Sculpting Custard, and I use it coupled with this to do wash and goes, and it lasts five days, so I would give that a 9 out of 10. I would probably purchase it again because it was affordable. This is a uh, curling jelly. I got this for a wash and go. Didn't work great, but for a twist out, it worked great for moisture retention, so I would give this an 8 out of 10. Um, High definition. So this coupled with its leave-in, Gives me a great wash and go. So 10 out of 10. We'll definitely rebuy it. It is expensive though. Kinky Curling. I will rebuy this as well. This is an OG. I've been using this ever since I went natural. But I used it for twist outs. Not wash and goes. But now I use it for wash and goes solely. And they are amazing. Let's see. Am I missing anything? Oh, of course. Last but not least. My beloved Eco Styler Gels. I have the Olive, the Argan, and the JBCO. I love all three of them, but if I had to choose a favorite, I'm going to go with the OG, and then this one, and then this one. That is all. I hope that was more chewable for you guys. Um, oh, I have one more. So I got the travel pack for the Audra, Audra Beauty so I could try the whole line. And what I didn't like from the line was the, the gel. I didn't like the gel. The Curl Defining Cream, though, I will repurchase that. That gets a 10 out of 10 because I got it twist out and it lasted the whole week, even when I worked out, and that's hard to do. So now that is everything. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and let me know what your favorite product is. And if any of these products work for you, all right, have a blessed week, guys.